Hey guys, so I thought I'd come on here and talk a little bit about what it's like to be a background or an extra on a movie set. I've done a fair share of that in my past and I've made every mistake you can. So I thought I would share a little bit with you today. So one of the first sets I was on was Siberia with Keanu Reeves, which was really cool. And I showed up, so it was supposed to be set in Russia, and in Siberia. And I showed up with so much clothes. I had a giant suitcase and I had a big garment bag and then I had another bag that had my mother-in-law's fur coat in it. I could barely move, I could barely walk, and I also brought with me the highest heels that I could find because I was going to a movie set. So, okay, anyway, so when it came down for them to check all our clothing, um, I only had one or two things that they liked and I had to wear my high heels because that's all I had with me. So I did get on set, um, I had a couple things. One of the things was my shoes had high heels and they were making too much sound on set. That is one problem. You wanna make sure you have, if you're wearing higher shoes, make sure they have a soft insole or not a soft, a soft heel to them. It don't, won't make a clicking sound because they don't wanna heal you. They wanna heal the actress. You're, we are just background. So just remember that you, you're not trying to be seen. And the more you're like that, the less you're gonna get on. If you're making too much noise or you're too brightly, dressed or anything like that, you're gonna get on set less. So it's better to go by the guidelines that your uh, casting director will send to you. So the other thing that, I, as I said, I brought way too many clothes because I didn't know what to bring. Now I only bring usually three outfits total. And usually I have um, one or two jackets that I can just kind of switch out. So give you an idea of what I would bring. Um, so you wanna have plain colors like, this would actually be good. I'm just wearing this at home today, but this is good because there's no pattern. It's a pretty neutral color. I would probably then bring a scarf, a bright colored scarf that would switch it up and maybe a light jacket. So that would give me actually two outfits right there. Less clothes is so much better. And even though they say no black, I always bring a pair of black pants and I usually bring a pair of jeans. And then I decide if I wanna bring something in between. Black pants seems to be fine for women especially. So um, this goes to set with me a lot when I'm doing background. It's just a nice blazer. Nothing too heavy. I can wear it winter or summer, it doesn't matter. And I can throw that over anything. And you can see already, if I throw that over this, completely changes my look. So it's a nice thing to bring. Now, um, I used to bring, so I'll put this down for a second. I used to bring a lot of patterns. See this or this, super cute on, but those won't get you on set. They will actually leave you in the holding area because you are too bright. And you, at the end of the day, what you need to remember is the sh this is about the actor. We are just the background. So I ended up buying these and they were actually all on sale. Let's see how much better these are. They're plainer. They're still pretty, so you still feel good on set, but um, they're nice, plain tones. So if you dress in the way that they ask you to and and adhere to like not having bold patterns and stuff like that, you will get on set a lot more. I found that I was getting on set so much, I just kind of wanted to sit down sometimes. So when you are going to be um, an extra, think comfortable shoes, I would bring two pair. Comfortable shoes, um, solid colors, and three outfits. Other than that, have a really fun time. Oh, and a water bottle, because a lot of these places now, you have to bring your own water bottles. So other than that, it's having fun and just, yeah, just have fun on set. Okay, hope this helped you guys.